viewer, thank you so much. If you are a new viewer, welcome to the channel. Uh, I'm just this average guy trying to live a little more intentionally, get 1% better every day, reclaim some past strength, and it starts right here, training-wise, every day. Um, uh, most days. <laughs> but anyways, it's Saturday morning, so we've got our usual Saturday staple safety squat bar. Um, uh, things to note, I did not sleep very well last night, so I don't have high hopes, but we'll see what this day holds anyways. Um, uh, I'm <clears throat> going to try something new, or not new, but I'm going to take my time warming up today. Uh, I'm actually going to go outside, walk a couple laps around the block, try and get woken up, then come inside and warm up. So, we have a very busy day today. It's Mother's Day weekend, so I've got to be at the store early, make sure they're good because our business is kind of picked up over uh, these last two days, which is a good problem to have. Uh, and we have a big family event around noon that uh, I have to attend. Uh, so a lot of outside things going on today. Not sure how much else we'll get to get to do today. It might be a slightly subdued set the tone Saturday. But it is what it is. We will try and set the tone today. Use this day to push on. So, yeah. As usual, I'm going to drink the pre-workout. Get warmed up. Get this day rolling. And have a good one. Let's go. All right, YouTube. Let's get this Saturday squat session review underway. Um, uh, set the tone Saturday. We had a great Thursday and Friday um, so I wanted to make sure that we carry the momentum into uh, today. We talked about last week that I probably wasn't going to do any more uh, bench squats, and uh, I think that's true for now. So we've got a slight new squat variation today, but more on that later. Um, uh, Warm-up felt good, uh, and I was super pumped to see 189.4 on the scale. Uh, so... Yeah, might actually uh, kind of creep down a little bit. Uh, that that uh, <clears throat> that depends on how dinner goes tonight. Uh, but uh, Mother's Day weekend, anyways. Uh, so don't have high expectations for coming out of the weekend the same weight, and that's okay. Um, uh, yeah. So we're still using the safety bar. I really like the bar, and uh, it's fun. So decided we were just going to do uh, safety bar squats today. I don't have that much experience with this movement uh, and then squatting to the bench it, it felt way different than just squatting with this bar I messed with this a little bit uh, when I got the bar several months ago so squatted a few times but just the um, uh, fact I didn't have the bench behind me met not mess me up but uh, was just different we'll, we'll just go with that it's just different it took me something took me a little bit to get comfortable with it and then this movement is challenging man i was not gonna lie i was worn out after this uh easy kind of just low volume day overall which you'll see we didn't do many accessories or anything like that but just from the main squat move this was pretty tough i had to uh work on some different cues as far as uh trying to corkscrew my knees out to the side to feel like i could hit depth and all that stuff but uh, it was super challenging, but in a good way. So I'm looking forward to seeing uh, what happens with this. So I did squat on last Sunday, uh, filming-wise. And so that's where I based my training max off of this. Uh, last Sunday, we only worked up to 175. And I felt like I for sure had 185 in the tank. So I based all my numbers off of uh, 185. Uh, for this exercise so following the 531 program been studying up and reading up more so I'm going to keep dialing it in um, uh, felt good to uh, hit 125 for five uh, then we had 145 for three here uh, and then we did 45 for three 95 for three 115 for three for the warm-ups and then moved up to our three sets of working working weight so yeah, 145 for three felt pretty solid. Uh, I was pleased with the depth. I think on video I looked pretty good. If there's any flaws, let me know. 
All right, last working set coming up. This should be 95% of what my training uh, max is. So for the 531 program, you do, uh, you take your estimated actual max, then base all your numbers off of 90% of that number. So um, uh, 165, the goal is for a single, but the, it's written as one or more reps. So we're gonna try and get it for uh, more reps and uh, move on, so let's go. Yeah, that was my biggest mistake so far in the programming was not catching the uh, or more reps on the final set of every exercise. So we'll clean that up going forward. Uh, but yeah, overall, please with this day, please with this movement. My knees did feel pretty bad afterwards. I will note that. Not sure if it was a technique issue, a mobility issue today, but it definitely, definitely hurt them. Uh, so after that, I decided to do some uh, split squats to try and, you know, make them feel a little bit better, get some blood flow to them, uh, just work on some general mobility stuff. We supersetted that with dumbbell RDLs. We did three rounds of this, nothing super heavy, nothing super intense. Um, uh, but I can tell you later in the day, Knees feel okay now, not as bad as they were, uh, but this was a good taxing movement, so I'm not going to necessarily not do it just because of that. Unless going forward, it doesn't get any better and gets worse, I think I can you know, rehab and mobility work my way around it. So uh, yeah, the plan is to keep working with that for now every Saturday. Finish off with a little bit of abs. We did not um, uh, lunge today, just to take it easy on the knees. We walked a mile and a half instead, so I'll settle for that. Then it was inside to do our personal development. Felt good, a solid start to the day. Uh, had to go take care of some stuff for the store, get ready for Mother's Day weekend, so nothing else crazy other than that. But we had a really start to the day, good start to the day. We won the morning, so that's what we're after. So, we're going to wrap it there. As usual, I hope you get 1% better. I hope you get some small wins today, and I will see you next time.